Hey everyone, Dr. Brace here, Guelph Facial Plastics. It's Facial Plastic Fridays. I had a few questions after the SCAR talk that I did about the Pulse Eye Laser, so I wanna talk about that laser a little bit more today. And so the laser I have here at Guelph Facial Plastics is the V-Beam Perfecta, this guy here. It's not on right now because it's really loud and if I have it running, you won't hear me. This is what the handpiece looks like. And this is interchangeable. This is a 10 millimeter uh, handpiece, but I can go down to three millimeters and up to 12 millimeters. And spot size uh, matters with the B beam laser because depending on how big the vessel is that I want to treat, I need to change the spot size. So there is a little bit of finesse and uh, expertise required to use this laser, but it's not that difficult. Basically, what I do when somebody comes in with a red lesion, I look at the lesion and I kind of make my best estimate as to how big the vessels are and what spot size I'll need. And then I'll do some test zap. So I may be wrong and I'll switch out the spot size. And what I'm looking for is a blanch, not a blanching, but a um, purpuric response. So when I zap the skin, the red part goes kind of purplish black for a minute and then flushes back to red. That tells me that I've coagulated the blood in that vessel and I've induced enough injury to that blood vessel wall that it's gonna to start to scar down. And so I use this laser to treat uh, scars from surgery, scars from acne, uh, port wine stains, rosacea. Sometimes I use it to treat some skin cancer scars if they're not healing well. I use it on mole removal and cyst excision scars. I use it um, on acne. So if you have a lot of inflammatory acne, you can zap the acne spots with it and it can help clear them up quickly. Uh, I've used them on anything that's red, basically. So there's a video playing here and it shows me treating somebody with very red acne scars. And so you can see it's a tolerable treatment. There's no freezing on the skin. It feels like someone is zapping you or snapping you with an elastic band and there is a little bit of cryogen. So you can see a little spray that comes out first before the light hits the skin, and then um, the laser is delivered. So that cryogen is basically freezing. It protects the surface of the skin, and then the laser light hits the skin, and then we keep moving along in a pattern where we overlap by about 10% on this particular treatment. You can see some of the photos there, uh, how her skin is responding from very red acne scars to ones that are starting to fade. And so this will take a series of treatments. You can treat people till they're purple, so purpura, and really bruise them and welt them up and they'll get a quicker response, but it means that they have downtime for up to a week as their skin is healing. So we're doing a slow but steady treatment with stacked pulses, and that's what the V-beam laser does is it takes away the red. So I hope that's helpful. Everybody have a great weekend and stay safe.